Thank you, Karen, for your words, commitment, and service to Legal Momentum and to women and girls. Next, I'm pleased to welcome to the stage Carol Robles Roman. Um, Carol is Legal Momentum's dynamic president and CEO. So I've known Carol even before she joined us at uh, Legal Momentum, and I can tell you, she is full of energy and passion, and she's brought all of that to this great organization. And she's going to tell you a bit about the great things that Legal Momentum is doing today uh, to create a better world for women and girls that we serve. Carol? Thank you, Loria, and, uh, and to our incredibly dedicated board, and of course, Karen Kaplowitz, AKA Wonder Woman, except without the cape. Thank you. Um, it is an honor to be leading this incredible organization that's done so much for women's rights. It is a tremendous responsibility that I do not take lightly. And today we celebrate the achievements of four special women and we welcome you to our Aiming High family, 15 years strong. Ladies, your achievements make us so proud. So you all know our 45-year history advancing the rights of women and girls. Well, I haven't been doing it for 45 years. I, I, I wasn't even born yet. Okay, I see my husband glaring at me and my nose is growing. Okay, well, I was around, but I was in kindergarten. So, so what's our secret sauce? Our secret sauce is using cutting edge legal strategy, policy reform, and pushing, and sometimes nicely, and sometimes not so nicely, but we get the job done, pushing for new laws around gender equality in schools, the workplace, sports fields, in our justice system. How do we do that? We create legal momentum. This organization advanced landmark legislation that was a complete game changer for women's rights, putting new teeth in our justice system to protect women and girls. And this law has been replicated around the world. So Aiming High Family, it has been one year since our last formal gathering. And boy, do I have a lot to report. But I have, Karen Kaplowitz gave me four minutes and I'm gonna make this fast. Some highlights. We've been empowering young women and girls, old women and girls, all women and girls. We launched a mentoring program with the Association of Junior League International, Gender Justice Warriors, how to create power and change for women and girls. What is a gender justice warrior, you ask? Someone who is committed to equal treatment of the sexes. And I think it's fair to say, I'm doing some counting here, I think we got 500 gender justice warriors here today. What do you say? And we launched recently our President's Advisory Council with some help with our friends at Wild Gotchel. Thank you to bring together emerging leaders, new leaders, creating new interest in advancing the rights of women and girls in our digital age. And have you seen our new logo, our new tagline? Legal Momentum Leads. It's on page eight of your program in the letter that I spell out to you guys. We litigate, we educate, we advocate, and we defend for economic justice, freedom from gender-based violence, and equality under the law. And some quick examples, just to give you a sense of how we do that. We recently launched, this is a DV-free DV free zone in March. A toolkit for everybody who hires a woman, a man, for employers on how to protect the rights of survivors of domestic violence and sexual violence in the workplace. With a bill of rights to be put up in every workplace the same place you put up the rules on how to vote and if you need time off, because it's that important and everybody in the workplace needs to know about it. We filed a civil rights complaint in a very high profile action last year against an Ivy League college. Our 19 year old client had been assaulted. The school found the respondent guilty, but did nothing 
thereafter to protect this student and others. That and the Bill Cosby scandal has caused our helpline to be inundated with calls from girls from our 50 states. Our lawyers in DC and New York are sought after experts working with Congress, colleges, students, and educators on how to help girls in school stay safe. Not an easy job, but we do it, and we do it well. I'm going to brag about our new partnership with the federal government on a new program to train victim advocates around the country. We provide assistance to victim service organizations because when victims' rights are respected, perpetrators are more likely to be successfully prosecuted. It's as simple as that. And Legal Momentum are the experts, and we're getting the job done. We are taking our work around the globe. We're working with the Thomson Reuters Foundation, creating practical and innovative solutions to empower women around the world. We're leading two initiatives with their Trust Women Global Program. And the one that I'm most excited about, in partnership with international experts, we are creating international protocols for identifying vulnerable girls at risk of exploitation. Research shows that girls at risk, homeless, in foster care, history of child abuse, are out of sight and are out of mind, forgotten. And this abuse usually starts at the age of 12. So by the time most entities and organizations are doing training, they have missed our most vulnerable. Legal momentum is going to change that, creating the protocols for the United States and then working with our international partners to make sure that that's changed around the world. And that is a promise. My time is up, so I'm not going to have an opportunity, so I'm going to catch you later to brag about our clients the women that we've helped with anti-discrimination matters, pregnancy discrimination matters, campus assault issues. We are a lean, mean gender justice machine. And we are so proud to be here today and share our work with our Aiming High family and with all of you today. With your indulgence, I just want to take one second and to ask this lean, mean gender justice machine to please stand, if I may ask the members of our board to please stand and be acknowledged, and the members of our staff. We do not do this work alone. Please, a round of applause. We're now going to take a short break for lunch. I think it's 15 minutes, and then we're going to continue our program. So eat fast. 